Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, data structures, beta, learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 91. All right. So we can insert variables into a string with the concatenation operator, this plus sign right here. Uh, we're going to update the, you now have a new weapon string to say, you now have a with a space after it and the name of the new weapon. We're going to remember to end the sentence with a period. So here's an example that creates the string, the cringe inducing string. Hello, our name is free code camp. Like, couldn't you just say our company name or our company's name is free code camp? But no, nope, they had to say it in the most socially inept way they could possibly come up with. Uh, so regardless, uh, we're going to say const our name, free code camp, const, and then this is the uh, variable, and then the first variable, and then we're going to have const our string equals hello, our name is, then we're going to have this, pardon me, the space after is, then we'll have the concatenation operator or plus sign. I'm just going to call it that forever. Uh, and then we're going to say our name, which points to this thing right here. And then we're going to have a period after it, right? So it's pretty much exactly what we're going to do down here. We're going to select this uh, new weapon right here, and we will uh, take it all out of there, including the period. And then we'll say plus, and then we'll say new weapon like that. And then we'll say plus again, we'll have the uh, quotes and we'll say period like that. And so when we click go to store and buy weapon, you see we now have a dagger like that. Awesome. So let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 92. And we'll see you next time.